So what actually are histones? Histones are a large group of alkaline proteins which are positively charged. And they're firmly fixed to strands of DNA which themselves are negatively charged. The DNA wraps itself around the histones forming a nucleosome, which is basically a small package of information, something like a cookie on a computer. Because of this coiling and wrapping action, the DNA strands are dramatically shorter than they would otherwise be. Now the histones can affect the function of DNA and determine whether or not a particular trait for the DNA is expressed in the adult creature. This means that whilst they don't actually alter the DNA itself, they can act like a switch. That particular part of the DNA is either off or on. In this way someone might carry a gene, say, for a particular trait like hair colour. Because of the actions of the histones, their hair colour may actually be different or even change during their lifespan. It's this possibility of change that makes histones really interesting. Since whilst DNA of someone's actually fixed for their lifespan, it's not always the case with histones. Histones are actually vulnerable to environmental effects. So for instance, smoking may loosen a particular histone's grip on the DNA, causing it to slide along the strand. In turn, meaning a particular vulnerability to say cancer, which wasn't previously expressed, now may become so. So the person may in turn develop that particular form of cancer. Now recently there's been the possibility that DNA might not be the only form of inheritance passed from one generation to another. There's now the prospect that histones may also be passed down from one generation to another. This could mean that environmental factors may directly affect inheritance, but not quite in the way Lamarckian inheritance first suggested. Instead, the actions of parents or exposure to various environmental contaminants may mean that the DNA of their offspring may inherit traits which become switched on during their parents' lifetime. So that's histones and how they may affect inheritance.